Welcome to Iconic Estates, where we bring you spectacular homes. Today, we are in Paradise Valley, Arizona, and we are about to see a home that is, wait for it, about 52,000 square feet under roof. This home is available to you for just $18 million, but it would cost exactly double to rebuild this house today. You today are in for a spectacular treat. So I'm very excited for you to see. So we've entered this grand home. We're in the grand hallway, and I'm going to introduce you to the designer of this home who was involved since the early 90s, Juan Sandoval. So come join me. Hi, Juan. Great to see you How today. Are you? Gosh, so thanks for having in. us. Oh my gosh, this is a spectacular home. Thank you. So you have been involved since the early 90s as the designer of this home. Correct. What was the inspiration? Oh my gosh, the inspiration, uh, privacy, um, sub stability, substance, party. Absolutely. Well, this is an amazing place to entertain. So as we look at this courtyard, which it's one of many, um, this home, every single thing on this home was carved on property, was built on property, was fabricated on property. Mm -hmm. Juan said, if you can buy it in a catalog, it is not here. So this home is completely custom. Wait until you see the details that we have for you. Inspired by the Getty Villa just outside of Rome, this Tuscan villa takes advantage of more than 200 years of design tradition. And now we get to take a peek at this spectacular library. So Juan, tell us a little bit about this gorgeous room. Oh my gosh, if you love reading, uh, we didn't want to take room up on the floor. So we suspended the mezzanine from the truss system and that's reached by a hand bent single helix cantilever staircase. This is all mahogany, Venetian plaster and an Escher style handset optical floor. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Gosh, I can't wait to get my books in here. <laughs> So we're off to the living room and there's a secret passage. Okay, this is beautiful. So now everybody keeps calling this the casual living room. So explain that for me. <laughs> it depends on your function of the room. It's been a formal living room. It's been a family room. It's been a television room. It's Casablanca style once. Casablanca style once, um, even dancing, obviously. Uh, so the bar is kind of a, a gothic rendition. Um, if you look, everything else is probably 16th century in look. The wood carvings are just amazing in here. You know, if this were my home, I would use it as a ballroom. It's happened, yes. And welcome to the formal dining room. I have got to direct your attention to this spectacular floor. It's literally like a kaleidoscope. This is a miracle of mother nature, this beautiful marble that was hand rouged together. So there's no grout in the seams, but take a look. This is better than having a carpet on the floor. It is beautiful and accented by the deep hues in this room, the spectacular ceiling. And it looks like it's time for me to light my chandelier because I like good lighting, but of course, you know, sometimes it's really hard to reach my chandelier when it's so high up, but there it goes. So this expansive kitchen can serve a small intimate family gathering up to 200 people catering. So Juan, how does that all work? Oh, well, five ovens, four sub-zeros, three large, you know, Viking stoves. Um, Anything from a true gourmet caters kitchen, chef side, plating side, restaurant style. And already right into the dining already room. Already right into the dining room and the outside dining room as well. Fabulous. And there's a wonderful, almost slightly hidden wine cellar here that 2, we're going to have to check bottles. out. All right, let's go see it. Let's see it. And so I'm loving this wine cellar and the temperature is amazing down here. So for Arizona, how is this place so cool? Well, uh, it's all concrete, it's sub-level, and so we use actually a convection pillow that keeps all of the cold air down here. You'll see there are no doors. So this is the place to have a glass of wine. So when you have a kitchen of this scale, you need a hood of great scale to match the room. This hood is seven feet tall, which is unusually high, almost 14 feet wide with Venetian plaster. And look at this amazing red plum marble and Spanish tiles literally bordering the back 
So this is an international kitchen fit for a king. As we enter the owner's suite, you can see that the tones are definitely much more muted, which gives you the feeling that you're in a more intimate area of the home. However, don't be confused. This is not one bit small. So back here, we've got double wing closets and master bathrooms that are amazing. Let's take a look at this one. And really, I think the piece de resistance is this amazing, amazing tub. It's a Breccia Capri marble from Capri, Italy. So this grand owner's suite adjoins a grand 150,000 gallon swimming pool in a lush, lush, lush green courtyard which just makes you, you feel have, like you are so far away from absolutely everything. I hope you've enjoyed our tour of this Mediterranean Italian villa today, represented by Cheryl Anderson of Russ Lyons Sotheby's International Realty. Yes, this home is for sale. And I hope you enjoyed hearing from the designer, Juan Sandoval, who spent literally 10 years designing this absolute paradise. I want to encourage all of you to tune into Iconic Estates on IconicLife.com. Every month we're featuring spectacular properties. We've got video, we've got photography, and we've got a fabulous newsletter that you can subscribe to. So if you want to see more, Join us at IconicLife.com. And now, it's time for all of you to go.